Hey guys, it's Rin Black, and I'm here with uh, Nambler from Co-op. Co-play gaming. Co-play gaming, and we have, Eric. of course, Eric and uh, Chris on from here from Stubber Bucket, and yeah, we're on yeah. our Minecraft server. Yeah, guys, gonna... if you were watching from my channel, definitely go check out Stubborn Bucket. You know our intro. Hello, welcome to Co-Play. And, <clears throat> like I said last time, they do awesome Let's Plays, and they're an awesome channel, so link will be in the description. Yep. They now, it's the word awesome. <laughs> awesome, awesome, And we'll have the same thing on our channel, actually, so if anybody yeah. wants to sit there and check out Co-Play's gaming channel, go in the description, and it will be there. If you like noob channels, then come check us out. <laughs> So where we left off last time, we were looking for specific materials, and I found this little gully here with some of the stuff that we need. But, of course, I ran out of a uh, pickaxe. So, let's say you're out in the middle of the wilderness, you don't have enough wood on you to make uh, a crafting table, you didn't happen to bring one with you, what do you do? You cheat. You look at the ground, <laughs> you press this cheat button, which is C. What? Tell I made a crafting grid. That's awesome. So you can right click in any items that you want to. You see I placed two sticks Whoops. there. Um, so just to break it, you can either click C on it or you can just attack it and it'll break. That's awesome. Oh, hi zombie. You're annoying. Um, I got now, my dust. As you can see here across the top here, I'm placing that. It creates a pickaxe, like a hovering one there. That's awesome. Look at it and hit C again <laughs> and it'll add that item into your inventory. I like how they have a mod just for cheating. <laughs> it's it's um it's a nice little way to have a crafting bench, and it's um very interesting uh, to to have something like that available to you in the middle of the field. Now, remember I was telling you last uh, maybe two episodes ago. Look for things. This is air infused stone. It looks like stone with coursing power through it. It'll glow in the middle of the night, of course. You know, you give it a little hit, it gives you little sparks too. So go ahead and mine that up. I was expecting like a big thunderbolt to come out and kill yep. me, but thunderbolt of lightning, very <clears throat> oh, sorry. Very, very frightening. <clears throat> and if there's more, and that's probably come out right there for Ars Magica. Yeah, yeah. Now over here we have uh, the black infused stone, right here. Now that's entropy infused stone. Now that's the the chaos uh, stone. You can cut that down too. It works the same way as the air stone. Your entropy and it'll give stone you a away from my farm. Now, this is what we were looking for for the grindstone. This stuff is called Certus Quartz. Now, it's useful not only in early game where we need it right now to get uh, more uh, ore and stuff just to begin, but it's good for later use when, if we would decide to create something called an AE system. Um, AE systems are definitely an involved process, but it's basically another computer to store all your crap in instead of having thousands and thousands of chests. But thankfully, before we have to, you know, spend hundreds of hours building something like an AE system, um, we can build something called uh, an, the Iron Box mod, or the Iron Chest mod, um, where you can upgrade standard chests with iron chests, um, and then up to gold, um, and then up to... Uh, I think uh, after gold diamond. is diamond, and then crystal is after that. So, I mean, we're Which gonna ball around in here. I'm sure yeah. we'll all see all that wonderful stuff in a future Does it time. Does really take that long to build the computer <clears throat> inventory? The AE system is resource intensive. Yeah. Um. So if you can tell me that you currently have like a whole bunch of diamonds. Yeah, that's right. Uh, yeah. I never built one before. I just um, our current goal, I would say, is after yeah, we we have a house set up by Bosco, I would say get a quarry. Once we have a quarry, um, everything is go because that'll help us dig down to um, you know, ground level, and we'll be able to move on from there. Um. Now, getting to that point, I would say there's a couple of other things in the way. We need power generation to run the quarry and some other things, but, um, I mean, that's all comes in time, you know? Now, should I take up this, uh, tarma root? Good question, yes. Ren. Grab the tarma root. If Are you, you if, guys finding yeah. any Zycorium? Now, Zycorium, that's from Zycraft. I don't know if Zycraft is, uh, installed on this mod. I... As much as I'd love to have it just for one thing, I'd prefer not to, because 
there's a few really fucking awesome things I can do with it, but for the most part, I consider it broken. Oh, okay. Um, Nate, a lot of over shit here. With it when I played with it. Yes, there, sir. I think they're working with a, a new knight. You can see that's uh, order and a few shards right there. That's something you want to gather. All right. Of course, all the uh, iron because that stuff's awesome. Yeah, we need iron for everything. <laughs> and yeah, vanilla. iron is uh, also. Honestly, between um, any mod, iron is the one item that is used the most. Um, even in the magic mods, they use iron a lot as well. Oh, wow. Now, this is marble. Um, Project Red uh, was a, uh, a compilation. A couple of modders tried to put back together the red-powered mod after, I think, the mod author decided to step away from the uh, keeping it updated. The Project Red uses a lot of the same things that um, the Red Matter or the, the Red Power mod had. No relation like to Red Craft. And all that kind Correct. of awesome stuff. <clears throat> no relation to Red Craft. I don't know if you've ever right? used micro blocks. Uh, mm -hmm. I have seen them, yes. Yeah. You can create some awesome designs and stuff with, you know, half blocks and quarter blocks and eighth blocks and all that kind of stuff. Paneling for wiring is the shit with that. Yeah. Um, and of course, you know, we have two different types of paneling. You have the covers and, and panel a part of the, uh, the micro blocks, and then you have the, um, the facades from, I think it's open blocks, uh, for things that can't take it, like the pipes and stuff from IC2. Uh, but I think we got most of the stuff that's in here. We should get out of this hole and get back to the house. Back to now. home. And I have no food, so I'm going to be super slow. Uh, I'm I'm going to be super slow, too. We should grab... I'm going to go into spider mode. I'm going to kill this chicken. You're going to hey, be chicken. going to chicken mode? <laughs> I'm a spider. I will eat you. Get back here, chicken. A uh, sulfur. Uh, uh, I'm a chicken. Your soul is mine. Hey, sulfur, what... Or anything. <laughs> oh, can Dolfer, you not turn into um, a chicken? Sulfur we can make gunpowder with. Yeah, I can turn into a chicken. Hold on. Oh, okay. Uh, bloop. Chicken. You guys want to go down into a mine shaft with me? Yeah, we can be over there in a second. Ooh, ooh. I'm a, I've been inside of it for a while. Clipper? Actually, I think we're right above you. Are Honestly. we right above him? I can see a nameplate underground. That's me. Yep, he's right underneath of us here. This is you, right? <laughs> the chicken who's diving underground, yeah. Oh yeah, dive bombing chicken. Oh, whoops, I fell in. <laughs> Thankfully, I'm a chicken, so oh, a tiny nice. shape. That's good. That's actually very helpful. So, um, yeah. Um, actually, the 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 best thing about uh being a small one block creature is that you can fit around the micro blocks and stuff in the game. All right, we're breaking uh, the first rule of Minecraft, guys. Come on. You never dig down. Um, never dig down. But you know, whatever. <laughs> now, I don't they see... They go chicken. Chicken tunnel. I created a chicken tunnel. What? <laughs> Just Let's Bosco. go get Bosco. We're coming, Bosco. I'm now, mobs bed. can see in the dark a little bit better than uh, actual Whoa. players can, so... I found awesome stuff. What'd you find? I don't know, awesome stuff. Oh, that's um, uh, the earth infused shards. I got cinnabar ore. Cinnabar ore is another thing. Um, when you when you cook cinnabar, you get quicksilver or mercury, and that's for... Uh, oh, whatchamacallit? Call me. Um, th for... Th Thomcraft. Uh, wow. I'm glad you're a genius. I just listen and pay attention when the uh, mod See, authors talk. Our channel, we just kind of hit things with a hammer until it works, and it hey. usually doesn't work. You know how I learned Thomcraft mostly? I figured it out. I mean, with the constant updates they have to it's stuff like that. <laughs> no, like, I'm not being weird about it. I just, I spent. A fuck ton of time and just figured it out. Sorry. Like, yeah, you better be. <laughs> I mean, with Thomcraft's books and stuff, I mean, it's.
pretty easy to follow for sure. Bosco's running I away. I think from I us. watched Dire. No, it wasn't Dire Wolf. It was Dire Wolf told me to go watch this guy. I watched his five minute intro and I said, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Some British guy and he had the coolest freaking Thomcraft house. Like, this guy's baller. Aha. Um, Bosco, did you ever go into this mine shaft? Okay, I'm, here's I'm something cool shaft. over here. Um, over here, uh, Nate. Yes, sir. Do you see on the ceiling, there are these weird bushes? Whoa, yeah. They're aluminum or berry bush, so right-click them like you would right-click a berry bush normally. Uh oh You see you can, you gathered ore berries. Yeah. Um, now, cut it down with your, uh, pickaxe. And we'll grab the bushes. Now, you can plant those bushes anywhere, and that will allow you to grow. Oh, sorry. I chose oh uh, to go back to normal size. I'm about That'll... to die. Okay. I need food. Um, you should be able to TP back to... Uh, who wants it? Uh, uh, Eric. He's Hi. outside, I believe. Whoa. Okay. And he should have food near him somewhere. True story. I don't have food near me somewhere. You don't have any food? <laughs> he, uh, he, you were working on a farm. Yeah, come on. Start that farm off, man. What are you doing? I'm starting my farm off. Uh, there's a skeleton, a skeleton there. It's going to kill me. <laughs> oh, more Certus Quartz. Okay. okay. Alright. So now we have enough Certus Quartz to... Be careful with that creeper. Start this grindstone. Now, there's um, an important reason that I don't have food. You notice how I've been underwater for like an hour? Yes, sir. Yeah. <clears throat> well, I need food. Um, I guess I'm going to go try to find a chicken without dying by creeper. Maybe over there. Um, in that general direction, you know. I mean, in Minecraft how, somewhere over here. Depends on how much or how bad you need food, but... I'm completely starving, and I have two hearts. Mm. So kind of. I kind of need yeah, food. you kind of do. If you TP me over to you, um, I will provide you with chicken. Oh, hey, let's, come here. Please, can you do that quickly? Yay! Right. I, was about, I was about to take care of your food situation. Well, oh well. Are you going to kill me, aren't you? No. I think you are. <laughs> No, I wasn't. I was just going to make it. I don't believe you. I'm staying away from you. <laughs> okay. You're not trustworthy. He isn't proven. I make food for you. Put the chicken in. Now, I only have two chicken. So... I have so many freaking ore. Zuh. I really wish they'd do some kind of master ore or something. Alright, I'm going to steal that Certus Course dust. Of course, I guess if they did that, Nintendo would sue them. You have the word master attached to something. There's a bit of chicken for you. <laughs> Thank you, God. So that'll give you three hearts back. So we need to go find a better source of food right now. Feathers oh, in there. If I can get to the point where I can memorize, like, building up solar panels, I'll consider that awesome. Yeah, that, that was a, be a good thing to do. Um, where did you go, Nate? Come over here. Right next Harvest to you. the berries. Alright. I like blueberries. Can we make pancakes? Now, a great thing with blueberries is, or any of the berries that you have here, they will overfill saturation. So, you know when you are you have, like, half a, a meat, um, and you eat, like, a, a pork chop or a, a steak, and then you don't have to eat for, like, a long time after that? Yeah. Technically, just like your health bar, you know, you have arm, an armor bar. Yeah. With food, you have a saturation bar. So... Um, even though these things only fill up like half uh, a corn dog or a half, uh, you know, like a corn dog. Is that like a leg of turkey or something? Whatever. Something. A food what icon. Even though only it only fills up half a food icon, 
um, it'll fill your saturation. So you can go through another set of them completely. Like, you can go through stacks of berries and still be eating because it will um, fill your saturation up past the point of full. So you never have ah. to eat for a while. That's cool. Um, but the other thing is, uh, let us build us a uh, grindstone. Um, if you want to join me in this uh, tinker table here. Yes, sir. Um, so a grindstone. A grindstone is uh, an item that will help you double ore in the beginning. So I don't know if you can see in the crafting station the little holographic that I have there. Um, I don't um, know if that's individual or not. So Yeah, I don't see it. All right, so for a grindstone, um, you need three cookstone, two cobblestone, three certus quartz, and a wooden gear. And what? So this uh, you said replicates ores or something? Mm-hmm. Awesome. It doubles it doubles your ore. Um, and it's through manual crafting. So <clears throat> we'll take one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Just because I'm crazy and I don't want to waste the uh, crazy the ore or the coal itself on. What should we call it? Crazy. Um, also, Crazy girl. Get that smeltery going. And it's... Nice. <clears throat> Alright, that should be enough. There we go. Alright, back into here. Now we'll make something called a wooden gear. Oh, okay. Now, I see. Gears are four sticks and a plus sign, basically, um, with the center empty. Gear at the top, three stone, one there, one there, one there. Vertus quartz here, here, and here. And two cobblestone for the base, here and here. And we have a grindstone. Grindstone. Now, this grindstone you can place down next to wherever you want to do your Anything. ore doubling. So, let's, uh, let's shove it right here. So it looks like a furnace almost. Come and look at it over here. I see, yep. And there's one thing you need to make it work. You need some sort of power. Well now, we don't really have anything but, uh, you know, our own hands. So, we need something called a crank. A wooden I crank to be exact. I in this game so I can power things with them. I love it. Right. Um, and then... A crank is basically you just fill the top row and the right row I see. with sticks, and you get a wooden crank. <clears throat> and this is the neat part. You shove the wooden crank right hey, there. Can shove it in a hole. Me? Hey, can you guys CP me right now? All right. Uh, go ahead and jump to him. I'll follow you. Oh, TP to you? Oh, my God. Did I kill you? Sorry. Yeah, no problem. I was getting attacked by like fucking like six different. No problem. <laughs> well, you get the you get to dig up your own uh, grave over here. Yeah, everyone move. They need to worry about other people killing. Nice uh, Skyrim. Everyone hat. move away. Oh, you saw it. Yeah, back up a little bit, Bosco. His inventory is gonna explode out of his gravestone, and he'll be able to pick it up. Haha, thank you. Now.